All right, maybe I should make one right now. I pay to be here. <laughs> Wait, who are you paying to be here? You don't have to pay anybody to be here. I'm not paid to be here. I still, I still want the money. Why do you think they're anonymous sub? My dad's just out here encouraging me. He's like, oh man, should we be going through it? Do not give random people permission to perform a brain operation. You know what? That's pretty good legal advice. That's pretty good legal advice. I can't speak the name. Is it Shmaimai? Is Shmaimai making you um pay for this? <laughs> is this is this little scamp making you pay to watch the streams? He's a menace. He's a menace and a half. <laughs> I'm not a lawyer. Oh, okay, I see. <laughs> well, that means that I will follow your law advice perfectly. I'm not paying to be here. Yes, I paid, but not to be here. <laughs> well, thank you. Thank you. Thank you for being here regardless. Even if you're being paid, I'm going to talk to my father about this because I don't want him to pay people to be my friends like he did when I was in school. He didn't actually, but it was a running joke between my best friend and my dad. And that was kind of weird. They didn't like, they weren't like friendly on any other terms. I mean, like they're friendly enough in terms of like a best friend and um, your fr your best friend's dad. It's just like, hey, how's it going? Good. How are you? Good. But aside from that, they just kept always joking about how she was being paid to be there to hang out with me. And at first I was like, that's really funny. But then after the 10th time, I was like, okay, guys. Okay, guys, that's enough. There's only a certain amount you can do that before it gets weird. <laughs> <laughs> and then I start feeling panicky because now I'm like, oh no. Um Is not Mimi dead? Uh who are you talking about? David, who are you talking about? There's no one here by that name. Are you getting tired? Maybe you need a nap. Hmm? Maybe you need a nap. <laughs> I'm not a dog. <laughs> A typo allowed me to learn how to shoot bottomy? Let's go. <laughs> wait, wait, wait. I don't know if I can let you do that. I don't know. I need to like train you. I got gifted a sub without being followed here. Sounds like your dad paid to be. <laughs> no! My dad. After what I've seen, I should just get money from suing you and get out of here. Well, uh, you and what lawyer? Hmm? The bit stopped being fun. It did. <laughs> no! <laughs> <laughs> guys, you're okay. Stop again. This this bit. It's funny now. Okay, you guys are like ha 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 being paid. Ha, ha. In a year, I'll be like, oh my god, are, is everybody actually being paid to hang out with me? <laughs> a bit. No, stop, stop, stop. Okay, let me just make a custom reward real quick. Um, Mimi will shoot bottomize you. Not a lobotomy. It's very different. And way less harmful. Perfect. How much should a shoebotomy cost? I don't know, like 500 points? That feels right. Um, create. Okay, shoebotomy. <laughs> <laughs> One point I got gifted a tier 3 sub to someone I wasn't even following yet. That's kind of incredible. That's kind of incredible. Maintaining the biz are top priority. Okay, as long as it's a bit, guys. Do not breach your NDA. Yeah, for legal reasons, not a lobotomy, guys. Not a lobotomy. It's fine. I signed an NDA. Okay, Pyra. Hello. <laughs> Mwah. <laughs> Hello, Twixt. <laughs> Mwah. <laughs> you guys just want to get you bottomized? All right, sit down and perfect. Let me just uh. Nah. <laughs> Shinstone, oh my gosh! Five gifted. Stop! Thank you. This is so much. I I'm really getting um rewarded for shoe bottomizing people. <laughs> All right, Gifford. Nah. Hello, welcome to stream. Oh, Pyro wants to get you bottomized again. Okay. Mwah. Aiden. Mwah. <laughs> oh, Shinsta. Giga Chad also wants to get you bottomized. Okay. Mwah. Wait, there's some. Wait, hold on. There's more people I missed. ChatGPT told me not to engage for something called totally not for legal reasons, not a lobotomy. 
<laughs> I missed I missed Shrek. Oh, you want to get shoebotomized? Wait, I can do that right now. Like like in person. Let me just go downstairs and then just just I'll, maybe I'll do an operation more um, more 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 intense, you know. <laughs> Mwah. All right, I'm back, guys. Oh, Jonah Square, would you like to get shoe bottomized? Okay. <laughs> did I miss anybody? I feel like I did. Okay, let me just check. Let me just check. Uh oh, these are a minute ago. I need to go up. Okay, yes, I did Pyra, I did Twix, I did Imperfect, I did Gifford, I did Pyra again, I did Aiden, I did Shrek. Okay, Jonah Square! I already- oh wait, I just did that. Okay, Shinsta already did. Oscar! <laughs> Thank you for the hydrate, Gifford! Let me just sip. Juicy Pebble, welcome on in. <laughs> that was a quick one. Hello, Scepter! <laughs> <laughs> Wacky! <laughs> now, all of you who have been shoebotomized are now, um, um, you guys have basically the exact same brain, um, but now you are much more likely to watch a Shoemimi stream. <laughs> a new form of brainwashing. What happened down there? Oh, so basically Shrek is locked in the basement, um, and he's not really allowed out. But he's allowed to have internet just so he can be on my streams and hang out. Yeah. Um, so he uh, he wanted a shoe bottomy, so uh, I went downstairs, you know? And I gave him like a like a proper shoe bottomy. Man, I'm poor, I can't get shoe bottomized. Damn. <laughs> she maybe really is the greatest wife. See? Oh, thank you. <laughs> wow, Shrek, you're so nice. Boyo! <laughs> what was life like before the shoe bottomy? Um What do you mean? <laughs> is it okay if I keep my brain? Of course! Shoebotomy is totally optional. Wait, that feels wrong. I don't know what you're talking about, Shrek. <laughs> I was already super likely to watch. I think I was already doing that. Wait, hold on. Okay. <laughs> then maybe it'll have no effect on you, you know? I'm stuck here. Okay. <laughs> uh, I mean, I don't know. I don't know. You guys ask for shoebotomies. I can't be held liable for the consequences. Forgot to warn you, but I might have been contaminated with prions. Should have told you before you munched on my brain. <laughs> <laughs> it's okay. Oscar, that's a sacrifice I'm willing to make. I'm willing to get a deadly prion disease. <laughs> Just so I could shoebotomize you. Mm -hmm. I've never... I've not had a shoebotomy. I just like it here. Oh, interesting, David. Interesting. Interesting. I'm glad to hear. Um, but it's okay to say you've had a shoebotomy. There's no shame in it, you know? I don't want anyone to be ashamed of any medical procedures. <laughs> <laughs> Thinks it means a lot, you mean? <laughs> yeah, you're welcome. I will, I will contract a prion disease for all of you. I will. You can be honest with us, David. <laughs> you absolutely can be held liable. Well, not if I say nah. -uh. <laughs> that holds up in court. I know it does. Anyway, Omega Verse quiz. <laughs> How do you handle stress? Abuse others. <laughs> <laughs> I, before I would say um, Cry my feelings out But now I think I say ignore it It's not good I'm not gonna do it Your honor my client please uh, No you Exactly Exactly I might be turning into a zombie Totally drawn to brains lately <laughs> Oh Wow Wow Is that Are you trying to riz me up It's working <laughs> Never got a shoebotomy unrelated, but I can't remember anything from before I followed. Interesting. Interesting. Um... Interesting. That means the program is working. I mean... <laughs> I mean, nothing. Nothing. You don't have to be... Exactly. Don't be shamed for... No, surviving a lobotomy. The survival... Tr the survival rates are... Guy okay, guys. The survival rates for a shoebotomy is very, very high, okay? It's really, really high, guys. It's... It's... You know, it's like 9%. Is this a psychopath quiz? It's the Omegaverse quiz. So, what program? Oh, you know, the second you click follow, it, uh, you know, something just happens to your brain. And, um, um. 
<laughs> I don't feel like escaping the base anymore. Yay! 9% mana that's huge. Exactly. Exactly. Get enough shibatomies and you can even carve wrinkles in your brain. Exactly. And then you could just be really wrinkly. I can confirm that abuse others is how she deals with stress. She abuses me in Harley in unspeakable ways. Excuse me! <laughs> no, I do not. Okay, goodbye, Harley. Thank you so much for hanging out. <laughs> Have a wonderful rest of your day. She did it for the vine. I did. I did. 5% survival rate. No. No. The survival rate is 9%. Gosh. <laughs> she bought me really changed my perspective on the whole situation. <laughs> I'm glad. I'm glad. That's what it's supposed to do. That's what it's supposed to do. Truth. Joking. Okay. Suspicious. What's the survival rate for people like a sh two shoe Well, um, if it's 9% and then 9% of 9%, isn't that... That's how math works, right? 9% Because you do it once and you have a 9% chance of surviving And then at 9% chance of surviving That is now the next reality of being alive And then within that reality you have 9% chance of surviving So it's 9% of 9%, isn't it? It doesn't necessarily have to work like that Hello, Kip Design The 9% of people are capable of crossing. If you take the 9% that got across the first time, they're not they're gonna be able to get across again. But in that sense, that's dependent on like the person's ability to jump across. But Chubotomy is fully very depending on me. <laughs> right? This is because we're counting successes. While technically we're inaccurately including the case where you die twice when evaluating. Oh, you know that that's right. That's right. That's a very fair point. Wow. 
So guys, what's your role in a group project? Clearly I'm the one who stands around while everyone else does the math. <laughs> I don't like to be in charge. I... I do whatever needs to be done. Sometimes that's the whole project. Sometimes it's just a little bit. Watch Kitsu stream, I dare you. What is she doing now? I don't wanna... I don't wanna disturb her birthday stream. But tell me about it. I wanna know. I was long since with a sleep problem, but now that I got a shoebotomy, I'm feeling eepy. I'll head to bed knowing my brain has been fixed for good this time. <laughs> You're welcome. <laughs> Do a good eep. Thank you for thank you for hanging out. Bye. <laughs> Have a very wonderful rest of your day or your night, because you're gonna go and do a little bit of a hunk. <laughs> this is the portal Discord. Oh my gosh, I was <laughs> my my chat is filled with very very smart people, and I I I I would like to say that I think that I could be an academic weapon when I apply myself. However, I do not apply myself currently and most of the time. Therefore. I think people are smart. <laughs> That's the end of my sentence. <laughs> All right, goodbye, Pat the Sniff Stuff. Thanks for hanging out. You'll be on tomorrow. Exciting. <laughs> I'll see you tomorrow. What does this shibotomy entail? So basically, it's uh, it's me gnawing on your prefrontal cortex. You know? So it's going to be me going... <coughs> and then a kiss at the end for like a little band-aid. <laughs> Try and tell us. <laughs> yeah, I don't really know what a shoebotomy feels like because I've never gotten a shoebotomy. I've only given shoebotomy. So, can you have two shoebotomies in the first place? What is there to munch on if the brain is gone the first time? No, I'm not like, I'm not eating all of it. I'm just kind of gnawing on it a little bit, you know? So I'm like, <coughs> that's why like my mouth doesn't like fully close. It's just, <coughs> oh yeah, also signing a long legal document about not suing me beforehand. Exactly. You need to go out late at night to go to the store. It's pitch black. Hello! Welcome to Strain Nun Tabs. Hello! <laughs> it's pitch black and the street lights are the only source of light. What do you do? I simply won't go. Why am I going alone to phone a friend? Yes, I'm buff. <laughs> yeah, guys, I'm, I'm buff as hell. Oh, buff as hell. Buff as hell. No, I would phone a friend. I want to try. I want to feel the tingles. Can you shoebotomize my cortex? <laughs> it's a redeem now. What does brain taste like? That's a very good question. Um, I want to say salty. You know? Kind of salty. Uh, both more dense and squishier than you think the brain would uh, feel like, texture-wise. So, mm -hmm. Yeah, probably also quite fatty. Actually... I don't know if there's... there's it's, I don't know if the brain would be quite fatty. Oh, keep your time. You want to get your bottom wise? Okay. Mwah. <laughs> <laughs> for how many shoebotomies can average prefrontal cortexes be used for? Let's do the math. I don't know. I haven't tested the upwards end of a shoebotomies. Maybe chewy. Maybe a little bit. Does your field of study just not know that sort of info? Boyo! Well, um, I've never really asked anybody what brain tastes like. Or the texture of it, but I've held real brains and I work with real brains So I can kind of like guesstimate what it would be like to eat it Technically technically if I if I wanted to be if I wanted to commit a crime and I wanted to eat Brain I could like physically I could because I have access but I would never do that so I can't tell stream. <laughs> I can't tell you, chat. I'm sorry. Me stupid. Me how? How return back before? Um, it's permanent. Sorry. <laughs> you can eat pig's brain in France. I think it's mostly, uh, I think cow brain and sheep brain or goat brain that is like more dangerous. Like they, like mad cow disease is what they called it. Or Kirchfeld disease. I think that's the official name for it. Um, there are prions there. That's all the questions we need to research. Depends if the subject is a three head or a five head. Exactly. Five heads can take more. Best redeem ever thought of, even though I'll never redeem it since I don't need a shoe bottomy. <laughs> I'm glad you like it. What the ethics board doesn't know won't hurt them. <laughs> no, guys. Okay, I'm not gonna eat brain. I'm not gonna eat human brain, okay? I would never do that. I would actually never do that, okay? One, because um, that is very, very precious material. And again, it used to be a person. Um, it is a person's brain. I would not do that. That is terrible. That is terrible. I would never do that. Two, I think it would taste icky. <laughs> 
problem was feeding cows the cow brains. Yeah, I think it's not as big of an issue now. I think that was very limited to a specific herd of cows. Um, so now I don't think it's like as pressing of an issue, but I would still not eat brains because prions, there still might be prions we don't know about just in brains, you know, so I wouldn't do that. Okay. Uh, guys, I'm not suspicious, okay? Yeah, I, yeah, also, yeah, that's also a very good point. It'll taste like formalin. You cannot, you cannot eat formalin. I would probably die. <laughs> yeah, three, it's covered in formal. Super Moorish. <laughs> oh, yeah. <laughs> not even a small bite. The thing is, most of the brains that I handle are actually quite small already. So they're already like a small chunk. So a small bite would just be the whole bite. Ow. <laughs> <laughs> You're sitting in your class, your teacher's being frustrating. How do you handle it? Complain to a friend, confront them, complain about it, make sure the teacher hears, yell at them, and walk out way more dramatically than necessary. Talk to, be passive aggressive, ignore it, give them the benefit of the doubt. I'll probably just complain to a friend. I don't think I'll do anything. Hello, Spiral! Welcome! Oh, thank you for the follow! Loner Flex. Oh, Loner Reflex. <laughs> She's calling her patient stupid. I'm not! No, I'm not! Stop that! Nuh-uh. Okay. Everybody who gets shoebotomized is very, very intelligent. If anything, shoebotomies make you smarter because now you you are cultured enough to watch shoe mini. <laughs> CWD is a problem that's all the rage nowadays. <laughs> you say that as if it's like a drug, and I love you for that, Poppy. <laughs> they have small brain. No, no, no. Like, I... So, basically, when I do an experiment, I don't get the full brain. I, I put in a request with, um with people who specialize in section, like cutting the brains into smaller areas. Thank you for the head pats, loner reflex. Um, and then I get those smaller chunks, basically. That's why I'm saying they're small chunks. Shibonomies are awesome. I never felt this much love towards Shimimi. Man, I love life in Shimimi's basement. See? See? Smart. <laughs> yeah, kids behind the school just snorting deer brain. <laughs> what a terrible image. <laughs> My favorite emoticon. Okay, hold on. I really like, um... Wait, they don't have my favorite. I like the little C. You know, you do a little C, you're like, mm -hmm. Like a little, mm -hmm. Like a... Like this emoticon. Why don't they have that? They don't have that. Okay, well, the closest is this one, right? Yeah, it's my favorite. It's not even here. <laughs> Okay, I'll just I'll just go with this one because I kind of also like this one, so I'm gonna go with this one. <laughs> I'm glad everyone knows what I'm talking about. The little C. <laughs> it does clear. It does clear. It's pretty great. It's pretty great. I just like the little C. It's kind of like a little sh uh, like a. I feel like I feel like when I look at that little emoticon of just like the little C smile, it feels like. That's a little face bye bye. of a shit stirrer, you know? Bye bye, Jasmine! Thanks for hanging out! Like, whoever's typing that is like, <laughs> a little mischievous. A little, a little, a little conniving, a little devious, perhaps. Thank you for the follow, Raster. Thank you. Oh, they have a nose. That's very cute. Yeah. <laughs> um, actually, Antarctica is not a country, okay? It's a continent. It's a continent. That's right, right? I didn't just say something stupid before saying, um, ac <laughs> um actually. <laughs> Where would I move? Probably none of these places. I like living in Canada. But if I were to move... Um... <laughs> You're right. Oh, phew. We can make it one together. <laughs> Everything is possible. Everything is possible when you put your minds to it. France? <laughs> Oh, uh, je suis a uh, shumimi et uh, <laughs> je vais emménager à la France. <laughs> yeah, Canada is pretty swell. I know uh, I'm Canadian, so French is the second language of Canada. So that means I had to take French lessons when I was a kid um, in school and stuff. I know some of it. I think I know... Mm, I know enough. <laughs> <laughs> is this the country Chad? <laughs> or someone named Chad? She wants to go to France so she can eat brains. <laughs> oh, wait, yeah. <laughs> French sucks ass, though. It's... I... 
I don't think I'll be able to get it properly. You know what I mean? It's kind of fun though to do like a little friend jet. Oh, <laughs> yes, way show me me. <laughs> I think I would say I want to move to New Zealand. Sorry, David. I'm not moving to England. <laughs> what color is math? Green. Do you guys disagree? Is math green? Thank you for the follow, Lord Dio. Thank you very much. The French accent's very attractive. The way I do it is, oh, uh, I am the Shumimi, and uh, I am here to, to, to stream. Blue? Definitely blue. I disagree. For me, blue is science. Blue is science, okay? Math is blue only. Yeah, math being green is correct. Thank you. Thank you. Actually, sorry. Blue is English. I apologize. Science is, yeah, science, science is red. I think science is red. What, what? Oh, social studies is yellow. Oh, do you guys call it that in you and other, in other countries? We call it social studies or history for non-Canadians. Yeah, science is blue. Science is... No, no, no. Sorry. Science is red. Okay, English is blue. <laughs> God. Okay. English is blue. Okay. Science is red. Math is green. Sometimes math can be red and science can be green. It depends. Okay. And then, yeah, history or social studies for me is yellow or orange. English is blue. That is something I'm certain of. For me, English has always been blue. <laughs> oh, everyone's, everyone, everyone's disagree. Okay, 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 okay. All right, all right, hold on. New poll. What color is math? Wait, what, where, what were the options? Let's go back. Okay. Red. Blue. Green. Yellow. Start poll. Everybody vote. Everybody vote. I mean, this is very important. Okay. Math for me is personally either green or red. I'm going to say green because that was my initial answer. <laughs> Math is yellow. English is red. She made me casually start the war. <laughs> my option isn't there. What was your option? These were the options that's here. I'm sorry. She's colorblind. <laughs> That's why math has been hard. Orange. Well, I'm sorry. I'm sorry. But I didn't make this quiz. So, you know what? I'm not sorry. <laughs> I'm not sorry, Manx. <laughs> Science is red. English is blue. She means smart, smarter than you. <gasps> Thank you. That's so good. I'm going to give you an applause for that, Mort. My, you're so cool. Feel bad for people raised with math as blue. I personally give my condolences. <laughs> Blue winning is kind of whack. Kind of whack. Kind of whack. Okay. <laughs> I, I'm also cool with math is red and science is green. I'm cool with that. All right. Um, but math. Wait, what was I saying? Okay. I, I, I lost my opinion. <laughs> I forgot what I said. Okay, math is green. Math is green. That's what we're sticking with. Next. <laughs> science is... Wait, that's really good. Science is cyan. Math is blue. English is blue for me. Do you like Andrew Tate? No. Loser. El Bozo. Anyway, what type of clothes do you wear most of the time? Um... Right? What is this quiz? <laughs> Guys, here are your options for clothing you wear most often. Hoodies, loose fitting, flowy clothing, pastel pretty clothing, or the sluttiest shit on God's green earth. I want to be the most- <laughs> Or do you wear the misogyny? <laughs> Um, I like oversized fits because I feel cute in them. So I'm gonna go with uh loose fitting flowy clothes. Favorite trope. Ooh. What's this quiz even for? To see what I am in the Omegaverse. 
<laughs> I did not check these quizzes. So I apologize. But also this was like one of the top quizzes. So um, my favorite trope. What? What is? What do some of these mean? What is this? What does this mean? What is PWP? Shimimi is beta coded. Wait, I don't know if I want to be beta coded. <laughs> um, I like enemies to lovers, but only in 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 gay relationships. The same quiz that Ava and I sent to a bunch of people, including Bo and Harley. No, I think Lolly has done it, so I think it's okay. <laughs> I do like fake dating. I think that's silly because it's like, <laughs> oh, I love you so much. Why? Like, oh, meh. But then later on, like, okay, hold on. Whoa. Sorry, that was actually kind of. Okay, fake dating. Next. The worst that could happen is she gets banned. No. <laughs> Which of these fanfics would you read based on the tags? Major character death, angst, hurt, no comfort, found family terminal. What? 